Oh man, oh man. All right, let's move on to uh, Cobra Kai. What's this uh, Cobra Kai thing? So, it, it it's kind of connected to my previous one. Um, it's just so there. I want to I want to actually get your opinion about this. And so, I have a real problem with you know trying to just throw out stuff as much as or as quick as possible to make money but i've actually really enjoyed cobra kai which i don't know if you know what it is um it's the remake of karate kid it was like originally by youtube it's on their third season and um they're now it's only on netflix but it's it's kind of this whole series based around the two main characters, um, which was Johnny Lawrence and um, oh gosh, how am I, how am I blanking on his name? Wax on, wax on. Daniel, off. yeah, Daniel, and um, and I've I've like really enjoyed. It. I think it's like quality content, and they're bringing back like all the old characters, um, and so they're talking about in this article that they're bringing back all of the characters from the original series. They're bringing back um, characters from Karate Kid 1, Karate Kid 2. The, prob the so, problem is you can't bring Miss back Mr. Miyagi unless you, uh, you <laughs> dig in the ground a bit. Yeah, yeah, which is horrible. I think we'd all like to see that. But I really don't, uh, I really don't know like how to, f how to feel about these, like, things that were so nostalgic in my past and then they're they're bringing them back and the first two seasons were really good but now i'm now i just feel guilty because i like shat all over ready player two but then i'm doing the same thing with like cobra kai so i don't know like have you have you been getting into any like remakes or or things like that are you you mostly all just with new stuff uh, to be completely honest, I, I haven't watched a single Cobra Kai. And, uh, the reason is like, I don't know why, but the Karate Kid was one of those movies that just like, just passed me. Like I never, I never, I would see it on like TV, but it, it wasn't, it wasn't one of those movies like from the eighties or nineties that was sort of impactful on my life. And so um, when Cobra Kai came out, the first one on YouTube, I was just like, oh, that's cool. They're, they're updating the, the story where now I guess the bad guy in the movie is the... Is he a good guy in the first season? No, he's a bad guy. He's, he's a bad guy in the first season. He's still a bad guy? It, well... Yeah, he's still a bad guy. And, and like, like Daniel and um, Johnny, I think in, in season three, they're, they're obviously going to have to like team up. Mm. to like take out the bad guy the bad guy was john crease which was johnny's sensei in the first one. Oh, okay yeah that is just i think i saw the karate kid i saw was the one with uh hillary swank oh that's it dude that's trash that's <laughs> trash i'm talking like original series and see that that's my point that's my point is it's so hard because you have the original, and I love the original. And then you get the Hillary Swank version, which was just, dude, shoot myself in the face. Was that was that and number then, two or three? No, so that was like number four. Oh. <laughs> so there was like one, two, and three, which I thought were actually pretty good. But then there's number four, and it's not it's not that like it was because it was Hillary Swank or that it was a girl or something. I didn't like the one with Jaden Smith or. Um, Will Smith's son either. Um, I just like, I think the reason why I like Cobra Kai is because it comes back so much to the original and it doesn't necessarily change that much from the original, mm -hmm. but watch your, watch your microphone. You keep popping. Oh, there you go. That's better. Yeah. I was on my zipper. I don't know. I just, <sighs> I go down these like deep dive rabbit holes and <laughs> so I think I think you're what you what you're feeling is what most people are feeling now that is, they're just they're just uh, been a bunch of rehashes the past 5 or 6 years that's like okay we've we've seen enough rehashes of the same stuff it's time to get yeah. something new 
Yeah. That's that's sort of what's happening here in Korea too, where all of the new um, dramas are based off of webtoons now. Um, mm. There isn't yeah. there isn't like an original. I shouldn't say there isn't, but like it seems like a vast majority of the dramas being made now are are based off of webtoons. Webtoons, yeah. And so it's like, well, are there no original stories or yeah. thoughts anymore? I guess I don't know. Yeah.